So, uh, Stephanie just asked me if we were still on couch surfers, and I said, you know, she should probably pass back through. Not a good idea. Gandalf was really clear about the rules. Come on, man. He's a cool guy. He probably understands. No work today? No, it's Saturday. Yeah, I know. I don't work on Saturdays. Yeah, me neither. Big day of couponing? Oh, the biggest. A lot of responsibility. I'm gonna go outside and get some sun on the old skin. You look great. Thanks. Brock's out there grilling. Who? Well, howdy, Rowdy. Hey. My name's Brock. Mark said it was cool I grill out here. Yeah, I, I guess go ahead. Um, just gonna lay out and get a little vitamin D. Cool. Yeah, I'm the next couch surfer. After I rock this turd burglar, I'm gonna be grabbing my one breakfast item. I know them rules. I heard Gandalf when he was over. How? How? I live downstairs. Mark and I hang out a ton. You do? Mm-hmm. Band saws are fucking jammed, so I figured I'd come down. Take advantage of the free time while I get him fixed. Hey, Brock! Ah! My dog! Hey, <laughs> Dude, Brock knows your uncle. That's right. Oh, how do you know Don? Oh, is that his name? I always just called him Big D in the emails. Well, why are you emailing my boss? Well, Mark told me your company name, and I was just sort of guessing after that. It's not too hard. I just didn't know his first name. Anyway, I wanted to put a feeler out, see what kind of events he's got planned. Oh, are you some sort of like caterer or event planner? Or? I'm a freelance butcher. It's sort of Atkins slant. I'm surprised you haven't told him about me. Me too. He talks a lot about you. I know a lot about you, Timbo. Brock specializes in rare meats. Ah, legal meats, compadre. Listen, you're not buying a meat in no Robin, Wisconsin anytime soon. You heard? Not publicly, anyway. Yeah, same goes for holler monkeys. Wink! Well, it's nice to meet you, Brock. Yeah, let's just say I know how to look the other way if you guys want to enjoy some tasty ball eagle. You know, I don't think you qualify as a couch surfer if you actually live here. Oh, I don't. I live downstairs. I mentioned that before, but you might not have heard me because you had your face in a book I'm on the list. Fine, look, I'm sorry, it's just that... I don't get a lot of time off, and I, I just get so stressed, you know? And I, 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 I want to come out here, and I just want to relax, you know? Yeah, 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 I feel ya. Pretend I'm not here. Did you guys ever know Dave? That guy was cool as a fan, man. Yeah. I really want to introduce you two guys. You'd really hit it off. That guy used to house dove hearts like they were little pop-tarts. Wow. It's real impressive. Yeah. An ungodly amount of tail came through here, too. Ah, that guy was a real slugger. Moi, I used to bat cleanup. Yeah, pick up his stray meat if you get what I'm saying. Yeah, I was just uh, texting a girl that stayed here a little while ago, so I think I know what you mean. <laughs> so uh, you're not going to eat Mark and I because we're a bunch of rare meats, are you? <laughs> well, I can tell your meat has soured, like you have old Greek yogurt coursing through your veins. Yeah, I'd have to ground you up and mix you with kangaroo or emu, something a little tastier just to cut the flavor. Mark, on the other hand, Ah, muy delicioso. Mwah! <laughs> All right. <Yeah. laughs> Probably tastes like a polar bear ate candy his whole life. <laughs> Brock says I'd fetch top dollar. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I want to come up here and take a sample myself. Oh, yeah. You're welcome. Put my arm in the grill. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to do it, though, because you have a birthday coming up, and I have a lot of fun at birthdays. Yeah. Oh, also, Brock has seen your whole DVD collection. Mm. Mwah. Magnifico DVD collection. Two faves, Five Goes West, Deer Hunter. Still got a whole bunch down in my place, but the Blu-rays are stuck in my DVD player, yeah. so. Yeah, it's because they don't work in a DVD player. You know what, guys, I would really appreciate it if you didn't go through my stuff when I'm at work. No, it was while you were sleeping. All right, quick question. Four strips of bacon, does that count as one breakfast item? Because those shits is small. Dude, I don't know. Your thoughts on this? I'd say go for it. Have two slices of bacon and then uh, whatever other breakfast item you want. Tim just went shopping. Thanks, Hoss. I'll tell you what. Why don't you go get my DVDs, and then you can have your one breakfast item. Well, I can't. They're jammed. You just bring up the whole DVD player, then. It's jammed under my buzzsaw, bro. Come on, guys! What is with this? Every time it's something that's not supposed to be... That's it. That is it. All right, I'm going inside. Everything's all messed up because of stupid couch surfers. The hell flew up his skirt. He gets a little cranky when he hasn't had his coffee. Oh, Tim, your phone. Hello? 
Oh, you got a text message from Stephanie. What? No, that was a phone call and you hung up on her, so thanks. Where's our DVD player? It's at Brock's house. 